With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. A particle start from origin at t equals to 0 with an initial velocity 3 i cap meter per second and move in xy plane with a constant acceleration of this. The x coordinate of the particle at the instant when its y coordinate is 32 is d meter then you have to find out d. So here it is given that the initial velocity is this and acceleration is this. So if I talk separately about x and y coordinate velocity and acceleration then I will write here ux is equals to 3 meter per second and uy is equals to 0 and ax if you see here the x component is 6 meter per second square and ay is 4 meter per second square right so it is asked that when the y coordinate is 32 you have to find out the x coordinate of the particle so let's find out the time when the y coordinate of the particle will be equals to 32 so i will write the second equation of motion in y direction so i will write equals to u y t plus half a y t square right so the y coordinate is 32 and uh, the y direction acceleration is 4 and you can calculate the time now so you will get t square is equals to 60 that is t equals to 4 second simple so we have to find out the x coordinate at t equals to 4 second so we can apply the same second equation in x direction so we'll write here x equals to ux t plus half ax t square so ax is given as 6 and ux is 3 so just put these values half ax is 6 and time is 4 so this will get cancelled out 3 and this will be 12 so we will write here 12 plus so 16 whole square is 16 into 3 it is 48 so the x coordinate will be 60 meter so in the question d value is asked here so the value of d will be 60 simple thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today